Welcome to Hitch Brothers. Introducing the Garth Hitch. The Garth Hitch comprises of a Bartlett ball and ring fader in the one hitch. On the demo model shown, the green arrows indicate to where the two main locking bolts of the Garth Hitch are located, while the orange arrows show to where the pneumatic hookups are located. Now you will see a transition from Bartlett ball to ring feeder. Once in ring feeder position, the bolts from the original green arrows are moved to where the orange arrows are shown, thus locking the hitch into position. Here you see a prototype model showing the air, electrical and hydraulic fittings, as well as the chain blocks. The hitch now pictured is another original prototype which has been fitted to a truck for 18 months and is in a working capacity. Please note that fittings will differ from current model. And now for a demonstration of how easy this thing really is. Here you see the hydraulic and pneumatic hookups being removed. and the ring feeder hitch released. Extensive research and development has been completed via computer CAD programs and the Garth hitch is compliant with ADR regulation 62-02, dated January 2009. And each individual hitch will be provided with a suitable compliance plate. Here you can see the truck backing up to a plant trailer, which is clearly suited to a Bartlett ball. This short demonstrational video will show you how to change from one hitch to the other. Up in the top right hand corner you will see a timer. The video along with the timer has been sped up for demonstrational purposes. Here you can see the two main bolts being removed from the hitch. They are located in the bottom of the hitch as the hitch is currently in the ring feed position. Once the hitch has been rotated, the two bolts can be placed in the top of the hitch, thus locking the hitch in the Bartlett ball position, allowing the user to tow with the Bartlett ball. For the user to change back to the ring feeder, it is as simple as reversing this process. Once the bolts are ensured to be tight, the hitch is now ready for towing. Once the trailer has been lowered onto the hitch, the hitch can then be put in the locked position as well as the air fittings, electrical fittings and hydraulic fittings reattached. Once the chain blocks are in place, the hitch is now ready to tow at full capacity. Hitch Brothers would like to thank you for taking the time to view this demonstrational video on the Garth Hitch.
Orders and inquiries for the Garth Hitch can be processed through the website at www.hitchbros.com.au or you can call us on 1300 446 412.